Hey guys, I'm back with a new video and today's video is going to be my October favorites. Now I hope I'm not too late. We're still technically on the first digits of October so I hope I'm still early. I wanted to do a monthly favorites because I haven't done one in so long. So if you guys noticed, I'm trying to catch up on my videos. You know, I've been um, not doing... I haven't been keeping up with like the same like say monthly favorites or with Ipsy all that stuff but I'm trying to get back on track so I'm really excited to bring this month's the, this monthly's favorite videos to you guys I don't have too too many products but I do have more of like my everyday that I've been using literally pretty much every single day like Monday through Friday is like my go-to products so let's jump right in and get started the first product I'm gonna start is with foundation because there is a foundation that I've been using I swear every single day it is now my holy grail foundation and it is the Maybelline Super Stay Better Skin Hydrating Foundation. Um, if you watched my first impression video you've seen that I really did like it. My first impression was I liked it. But now I'm telling you guys that I totally love it. Um, I totally recommend it. Again I am in the shade 25 Nude Beige. This is what it looks like. I have not seen anything miraculous, like miraculous, happen to my skin while wearing this because they do say if you wear it for two weeks, it's supposed to like improve your skin. I don't know if my skin has improved or not. I haven't. It hasn't gotten worse or it hasn't gotten bad, which is good. But all I know is that when I apply it and when I'm wearing it, I absolutely love it. It leaves my skin looking flawless. It is pretty much like I can say like more towards a medium coverage but it's almost like a medium to full coverage um, it covers all my imperfections blemishes fine lines it doesn't crease all that good stuff it this does a trick so I've been loving this foundation so I highly do recommend you guys to try it out if you haven't um, and it is oil free with SPF so that is definitely a plus if you have oily skin you might want to consider trying it out this might be just what you were looking for so that's definitely my first favorite that I've been using all month wait did i say october favorites this is september favorites my second um beauty product that i've been absolutely loving and this one i just discovered the month of september and i'm wearing it today if you guys can see it when you guys know what it is but i absolutely love it and it is the maybelline master graphic eyeliner obviously in black let me tell you guys that I have been using the Benefit their real it's real eyeliner I loved it because one I loved how the the um, applier the yeah with the little thing that you apply the eyeliner with was angled so I really like that because they made it easier for me to apply my eyeliner but when it ran out I was gonna go and purchase another Benefit it's real eyeliner but I came across this Maybelline one and I seen that, let me show you, the tip was just like the benefit. So I decided, you know what, in the meantime, from here to when I make my trip to Ulta, let me just buy this and see how it works. Let me tell you guys, this just became another holy grail. And it is like less than half of the price that the benefit is. It's like $6, I believe it was like 6 $7. I got it at Target. It is amazing. I I am in love with it. I recommended it to my younger sister and I told her, you need to definitely try this eyeliner. I really love it. It is super pigmented. It doesn't smear. It stays on all day. I was like, you need to try this eyeliner. Sure enough, she took my word. She went out. She got it. She loves it. And now this is her holy girl eyeliner. I absolutely love it. I recommend it. Definitely, I can say it's a dupe for the Benefit, their real eyeliner. So definitely go out and check it out if you want to save some bucks. This is the eyeliner to try. The next product is this Mauve Color by City Color. This is the color that it is. Like It's literally a, the perfect mauve, like an everyday color. Let me swatch it for you guys so you guys can see how beautiful this color is. Look at that. It is beautiful. It is very, like, it gives your lips the perfect pink flush. It is perfect. It looks natural. 
I love it. Uh, this one I believe I had from the Ipsy event and I had it in my lipstick in my lipstick mess it's a mess right now I haven't even organized my collection and I picked it up and I was like oh you know I need a everyday lipstick and now it's been like literally on replay every single month of the day not month every single day of September I've also been wearing my bronzer and this is by the model co uh, brand and it is a shimmering bronzer this one came in one of my ipsy subscriptions I don't know if I filmed the video for this one but I'm wearing it today as well and I've been wearing it every single day I I don't like go all out contouring like all of my face during the week and today I didn't do it as well but for the most part even when I just do a basic contour or full-on contour contouring this is my go-to bronzer so definitely I found my holy grail bronzer for now and my blush that I wear with it it's like almost all these products are my almost everyday looks that I've just been wearing like every single day um, this blush is a Milani I know I've mentioned it in one of my favorites video I don't know how long ago it's still my favorite I absolutely love this blush it's my favorite blush in this entire world and it is by Milani the Luminoso 05 blush it's already running out in the middle. Look at how gorgeous it is, though. It is a beautiful, like, orangey, coral, light, shimmery blush. It is absolutely... It's gorgeous. I also have been obsessing over my Beauty Blender. I have... I took so long to buy into the Beauty Blender um, trend. And I got this... Well, it's not the it's not the beauty blender, uh, but this is a Real Techniques sponge. And let me tell you guys, look how dirty it is. You can just tell that I need to wash it because I've been using it every day. I use it every day for my foundation, and then I use this side, the flat side, to apply my concealer, and I love it. I just absolutely love it. I love now. I know why people love applying their foundation with a beauty blender or the sponge because. It really does make a difference. The last makeup product that I've been totally my go-to for like dramatic look, mutual looks, warm looks, cool looks, you name it. It is the Jaclyn Hill's favorite Morphe palette. I'm loving it. It's what I'm wearing today. I love it. So let me show you guys the colors in the palette. I've been going absolutely crazy, you guys, using this palette. You can see I'm a little dabbing of the colors that I usually normally go for. It is just a beautiful variety of colors. Like, look at all the shades. You can do so many looks with them. So this has definitely been my go-to eye look palette. Loving it. Since, like I've been using it since I received it, which was like in June, I believe. But this was September. I've been trying out different combinations different colors and i have just been becoming more and more obsessed with it so if you guys don't have it and i don't know if it's still out there and sell but you guys can still get it i do highly recommend you guys go and spend your money on it because it's worth every dollar i only have two more products left for september and these are not this is not makeup it is beauty products for face and hair so the first one is this saint eve's um apricot scrub and it is a deep exfoliates to reveal smoother skin it is a deep exfoliator it smells delicious i absolutely love how fresh it smells and i just love it it is like four bucks in target you can't go wrong and it leaves your skin so smooth so soft and i can feel how the difference when i go into the shower when i'm out how clean it makes my face look not how clean it makes my face feel not look well it does look and it feels amazing so definitely this st eve's scrub is super perfect if you're on a budget and you want to have a good exfoliator on your hands this is one to definitely try out say hi okay and the the set the last uh beauty product that i've been having for september that i've been obsessing is this 
John Frieda Miraculously Recovery Deep, Con Deep Conditioner. Again, let me show you guys up close how it looks. You guys know that I've been struggling with dry hair, no volume, split ends. It's just everything that's negative that can happen to your hair, you name it. I've pretty much gone through it. So I'm on like the hunt of finding different hair products that can help on my hair and condition it and pamper it and treat it and make it beautiful again. It's a, it repairs, it nourishes, repairs, fortifies dry, damaged hair, protects against breakage. So pretty much after I shampoo and condition my hair, I apply this deep conditioner on my hair. I leave it for like five minutes on. Then I go ahead and rinse it off. I basically just focus on the tips and then just whatever is left on my hand I just kind of put it all over but I focus mainly on my tips because that's what tends to break out a lot faster and get more damage easily because of the heat that I do use from time to time with my straightener or whatnot and I really love the way my it's been having my hair um, it leaves it really silky really soft uh, no tangles like I can easily brush it and um, it doesn't um, hurt my hair like all tangled or anything it is really amazing this one I forgot how much I did get it for a target but I don't I don't I want to say it was under ten dollars but I'm not too sure but again it was really affordable that's why I also went for it and I am loving it so definitely if you have problems with your hair you might want to try it it's a deep conditioner so it might work for you depending on the hair type that you have, but it's definitely working for me. I have a song that I want to share with you guys that it's my favorite, that I'm obsessing, that every time I hear it on the radio or whenever it comes out on my Spotify, I'm just like, turn it up because that is my song. I just absolutely love it and I'm going to play it for you guys. You guys can see. And this is the song. My ESPN always comes out right I just wanna look good for ya It's Lena Gomez Let me show you how proud I am to be yours That song you guys, I swear Whenever we're in the car, I'm in the car with my husband and the song comes out, I'm like, stop talking, turn it up, and I'm just like, don't even interrupt the song. I'm just obsessing over the song. I hope you guys enjoy this monthly favorites. I'm so excited to finally have one up for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, it wasn't too many products, but it's been my everyday, pretty much my everyday products that I've been using. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Maybe you guys found some products that you might want to try out. So leave me a comment below if you maybe try some of these already and you like them or maybe you don't like them, they didn't work for you. Whatever the case, leave me a comment below and let me know. If you have any more requests, any videos you want to see, leave me a comment below and let me know. Again, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And like always, give my video a big old thumbs up. If you like my video and if you want to see more monthly favorites so I can get those up for you guys. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my fashion blog at fashionistaandthecity.blogspot.com. Follow me on Instagram at fashionistaandthecity underscore. Follow me on my Twitter so you can follow my tweet, tweet, tweet at sg underscore 24 where you probably see me tweeting lyrics from Selena Gomez's Good For You song. Guilty as charged. Um, and yeah, guys. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.